Hello everybody, this is Richard Cespedes and I want to upload a video to talk about um, uh, spirituality and the living and how um, what it really is. What it really, really is, is nothing more than just a, a concept. And what's really there is actually the afterlife. Um, this, this living place is just concepts and ideas, that's what it is. The reason why um, I think there is a lot of people talking about um, of being um there's a lot of people that are confused and they're confused because they are um too they are they are they're working off of and and leeching off of and feeding off of the concepts of others the concepts of uh of what what is all that what they see is basically all that there is that's what they believe what they see in front of them and what they think is all that there is and that basically we're in a bubble, uh, 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 like a cage, basically. A cage that's just a big bubble that feeds off itself and that basically folds in on itself. It's a basically like a snake. Like if you've seen those pictures of snakes that eat their own tails, and that's basically what our reality is. It's nothing more than concepts, devouring concepts, feeding off of concepts. And, and it's just all one, basically it's all one thing that really doesn't really go nowhere. If you, if you, um, if the concept is negative and it doesn't really perpetuate things positively, if there isn't love there, is there, if there isn't, um, good intentions there, then, then the concept is weak. You know, um, the, the concept basically is, um, manifesting knowledge from the knowledge that is there it's like trying to build everything everything out of one form of uh of matter or energy or material it's trying to build a material out of the same material that is just all that you know you try to construct you know um the way that we see our world the way that we see things how we perceive social problems how we perceive um, um, ourselves and how we perceive um, inventions and what perpetuates our needs, uh, what perpetuates our um, selfishness. It all feeds off of the same material, the same, it's all one same mass and it's all one same concept, feeding off itself, working off of uh, devouring from itself, taking from itself 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 it's building from itself and it's not really anything new um we think of it as something new but it, it, it's actually um you uh, what, what it is is that the reason why pe there's a lot of people that are confused <clears throat> i think that the reason why people believe there's archons and there's you know um evil entities controlling things and they're confused and there's racism and discrimination and fear and anxiety and the reason why is because we're just we're, we're um uh we just don't understand our reality and we're not using the right we're, we're not perceiving what is in front of us we're not perceiving what is in front of us and seeing it as something that is something that um that it that that can be solved in the right manner um we're the the, the, the people are basically the, the those things those negative things are being fed off of the same concepts and energy and ideas that that make up our reality that don't go anywhere and that um the only way to uh, to break free from those problems to find a solution is basically you know um just to get into it quick and, and pull back a little bit is to break free from the bu bubble <clears throat> bubble entrapment of our concept of our of our own entrapment of our own um ignorance of our own entrapments of the material of the of the concept in which we live in and that we have fears and we have anxiety because we're trying to solve the issues by using the same energy and the same energy and same material that created the negative concept because just to give you an example real fast we're trying to fix um these fears these negative concepts by using the same material concept to fix the negative concept the same material concept that made that very same negative concept and just to give you uh 
an example is kind of like trying to fix a broken hammer by utilizing the pieces of that hammer to make a hammer to fix the hammer you know we're trying to fix a, a the concept by utilizing the same materials that made that concept to fix the concept that's what it is that's what i'm trying to say is that we're in a bubble where we're basically in 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 trap it's form of entrapment within our own it's kind of within our own selves and that we're we're, we're trying to fix a problem by by using the same materials that made that problem and by not reaching up higher and breaking through the bubble concept the, the entrapment of the concept by breaking through and seeing and breaking i guess breaking the the fourth wall breaking the wall because what it is what we're trying to do is that we're just going around in circles is what it is is that we're trying to make a concept from a concept to fix a concept we're trying to um make an idea from an idea to fix an idea we know we're, we're not really going anywhere we're just going around in circles utilizing the same materials the same materials that created that very problem we're trying to make we're trying to make a solution out of the same material that created the issue you know and it's all one thing that's folding in on itself that's intertwined on itself that's interconnected with itself and it's all one thing that we cannot escape basically and that we're not really solving um basically anything that we're um that we're involved in emotionally you know socially or relationship wise we're not solving anything because we're trying to but we we we're trying we, we, we don't understand what is really happening and we're trying to understand um the world around us and and all that we use is basically all that we all that we think we know the only thing that we know to use is basically to use the the visual content of what is in our reality and what we hear and what we feel from others and from entertainment in order to to create something to solve the issues that are around us it's like trying to it's like trying to you know just like i said it's like trying to uh trying to fix a mud house out of uh with more mud you know it's like sometimes it works sometimes it doesn't but it's better this is the thing is that it's better to uh to maybe have a breakthrough to have a new concept that breaks through the entrapment of your own tunnel vision what it is that we're living in a tunnel vision of 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 basically not really seeing outside blinders not seeing the truth that are that is uh, around us and when you break free from the entrapment of yourself and the negativity of your world and the media and and, and all these things when you break free from all that then you're able to see something a little thin thread a shiny gold thread of truth that allows you to see beyond self beyond the self of this reality so that you are no longer entrapped within the within the very concept the concept of your world the concept that basically feeds off itself and builds from itself and off itself to create itself that basically doesn't go nowhere you know and even if it's an invention or not and that when you're then able to see that thread and you're able to see and break through from through from that you're you're then able to see the truth of what is going on and now instead of building the same mud to you know um, uh, you using mud to fix a mud house now you then break through and start to see a new concept it's no longer a concept this is the thing is that you break free from all concepts and ideas and you become truth and that's the afterlife that's truth totality you know to the totality of what life is is just to be just to be so that you're no longer living in the in a struggle of creation constant creation and constant creation and constant pondering and dwelling of social issues you just become i am i am you know you you, you become that and you break through and then now you're able to use stone or wood to build the house and you break free from that the concept and you become whole and now it's complete 
and that's what I'm trying to say here is that um, is that we have to break through. It's like um, it, it, what it is just to stay is what it is. We're so enthralled, enthralled in, in what is going on. We're so entrapped in what's going on that we don't realize that that we're, we're just so so knee deep in our own poo that we just don't realize that we just lost the we we lost the truth, you know. And it's not our fault, and it's it's kind of our fault, not our fault. But we can find a way out, and uh, we will, and that's after life, and and that there's people looking in on us, and that's basically it, man, and that's the truth, and. And we'll find a way out from all this and you know what it is is that the reason why there's fear and the people think there's aliens evil aliens and there's you know that there's lizard men and all this stuff is because they're using um because of because of their own ha unhappiness and their own struggles they're using the same materials to create to create a solution to solve a problem that was that used the same materials that created that same negative problem you know same the using a trying to make a hammer from a hammer to fix a hammer and it doesn't really fix the hammer that's what they're trying to do is that we're trying to fix a concept to to fix a con you know to fix the concept and we'll, we'll find a way out though this Ricky says but is I hope it all made sense and I had to get it off my chest thank you guys